my house has these huge windows in my living room. You'll be walking by and see clear into my house with these windows. I was around five or six. I would sit at a table and draw. I loved drawing. I still do. And that was my favorite place to draw since there was a perfect line and lots of birds outside for me to do out on a piece of paper. A piece of scratch paper. In my area, there were lots of ice cream men walking with those portable ice cream stands who would sell those Spongebob or Sonic ice creams. I began seeing this short ice cream man always walking in front of my house. He would just stare at me almost every day. He would walk around at my block and just stare at me. I tried to ignore him and look away, but I felt him looking at me through the window. Remember, I was uh, five or six, so I never told my parents. One day, I was once again sitting at the table drawing when I Look outside, and he was standing there, smiling. This wasn't a friendly smile you would give to a child. I was able to see his gums and all of his front teeth. His eyes were white, and I saw the whites around his eyes. He made a motion for me to come outside and heard him yell, Come on! I have some ice cream for you if you come outside. I'll give you some. I was very shy at that age. I didn't like talking to people outside my family, so I went to ask my parents, who were in, in the other room, if I could go have some ice cream from the man. They fortunately said no. When I went back to the table, he was gone. I haven't seen him since this incident. Sometimes I wonder what would have been if I didn't go ask my parents for permission and just go outside to him maybe I wouldn't be here typing this so weird ice cream guy you better pray we, ne we ever meet